Hello, I'm Dan Rogers, and today we're here with Mayor of Amarillo, Cole Stanley. Cole, welcome. Oh, thank you, sir. Great to be here today. What's going on with the city of Amarillo and its police department? Dan, that is a huge win right there. I want to give you some updated information. Um, City Council worked very diligently in September to produce a budget that honestly did what they said couldn't be done. We couldn't meet all the needs. We couldn't deal with the growth and raise our police officers and the police department salaries $10,000 without having to raise taxes. And this city council did that. So we didn't raise taxes. We were able to uh, put $10,000 into each individual position. And so starting salaries over there are now $70,000. We will pay you seventy grand to train you and put you in uh, our cadre. And you'll graduate as a uh, after that with your badge, and you'll be a police officer making seventy five thousand dollars starting pay. Um, <clears throat> we're forty individuals or forty positions short over there in our department of roughly four hundred. Uh, that is uh, severe, and and the way that we want to attack crime and and work for public safety, we need those positions filled. So. Uh, we normally have 70 to 100 applicants every um, academy that we open. This last academy, we have over 200 applications. Wow. And so our hiring is up 20%. Uh, retention's up 20%. It was heading down at around 10%. So we've seen a complete 180. This is a huge win for the city of Amarillo. And it gets to do what this council wants to do most. And we want to back our blue and we want to support those local heroes. And you do that by running an, effic uh, an efficient and effective budget where you are putting the money where it needs to go. Nothing more important than your people. If you don't have a safe city, you don't have a city that people want to live in. That's right. That's right. Well, that's great news. Thanks for that, Cole. We couldn't be more proud.